It was evident well in advance that launching the highest thrust rocket in history would put an enormous strain on its launch pad. However, even SpaceX did not anticipate the extent of damage caused by the super heavy Starship. In our previous episode, we focused on the first flight of the complete stack of Super Heavy Booster and Starship. Today, we will discuss the damage caused by the launch, rather than the launch vehicle itself. Debris flying off the launch pad could be easily seen even in the launch footage. Pieces of concrete have fallen hundreds of meters away, causing damage to cars, tanks and other launch complex infrastructure, and even the Starship Hopper. This footage from the La Padre channel shows concrete literally raining down around the pad. After the launch, photos revealed the full extent of damage to the launch complex. The concrete under the launch table had disappeared entirely, and the exhaust fumes from the Super Heavy had blown a crater several meters deep. One may wonder why SpaceX built the launch pad without a flame deflector. Unlike other launch pads, the company faced various constraints, such as the high level of underground water, which prevented them from digging too deep. Additionally, the goal was to keep the ramp as simple as possible. Elon Musk admitted on Twitter that data from the static fire of the Super Heavy gave hope that the concrete under the launch pad could withstand the stresses of launch. However, the reality proved to be a very unpleasant surprise for the company. A special water-cooled steel plate, which the company had been developing for several weeks, was expected to be used for further flight tests. Thus, it was sufficient for the concrete to withstand only one launch. Currently, the company needs to check whether the statics of the launch table and the service tower have been damaged. It appears that no more rockets will be launched from this pad for at least a few months. Thank you for watching this episode of Spaceflight News. If you have any questions or comments, please let us know below the video. We are delighted to hear about your interest in this topic and will be happy to answer your questions.